Ladies and gentlemen, this stupid ghost won't go away. Welcome back to Let's Play Earthbound. We are about to have the most annoying fight in the game. And as you can see, I advanced just a little bit from where we left off. A couple of levels gained. And Paula now has the silver bracelet equipped. So that's all that changed. That room that I ended in where I was in the fight. I just finished that and got here. So let's progress. Uh, yeah. This guy, really annoying. I don't remember if this works or not. Uh, I know this does, and... Should I use the big bottle rocket here? I'm gonna say no. We're gonna hold on to that. And hope that PSI freeze works. Wow, every single time that I have used PSI Freeze, it has just been awful. Do you have a healing item? No. Ooh, bash. You technically don't either. Use Thunder. <laughs> Do you have... No, no one does. Uh, defend. Well, that's not... That's double not good. And that's even worse. So crying is awful. I haven't shown this off yet. Crying is awful because it severely lowers your hit rate. Why is that bad? Jeff can't do anything besides physically attack. And Ness doesn't have enough psychic points to maintain this barrage for very long. Ah! No, don't. Don't spy, just defend. And then this prick keeps attacking. Please be enough. Just please be enough. I don't want to... No! <laughs> Gosh dang it. I think he only has maybe one more round. Please, PSI Thunder, just hit. And you! Stop being a... <laughs> I hate this fight. I hate this fight so much. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Are we going to go back? No. We are not going to go back. We're just going to advance forward. As silly as that is. Because... There's this guy. You don't have anything that I would like. Never mind. Saturn Valley. This is going to be a very awesome... Ooh. Ooh. A very awesome place that we're about to go to. Maybe when we're there we can get rid of this stupid ghost. That would be lovely. Uh, who am I kidding? That ghost is probably going to haunt us the rest of the game. Now, hopefully we don't run into anything terribly scary. That, that, that's a no. That is definitely a no. We've fought enough zombies. Once again, children with bombs. No. Please no. Please, please no. Okay. We're g <laughs> this game is insistent. Okay, fine. Fine. We'll f frick. Say hello to Farm Zombie, Armored Frog, and Red Antoids. I should have given the bomb to Jeff. <laughs> oh, I'm a dingus. Hopefully this will be enough to take out the Antoids at the very least. One down. Two down. Yes. Uh... That was fairly effective. Holy cow. I didn't expect the zombie to, to drop as well. It's called an armored frog for a reason. Now, I'm really hoping that eventually we will actually come up against something that PSI Freeze can hit for full damage. Because it's getting annoying that it's not. Ugh. Another present. What's in here? Don't talk to the present, Dustin. Uh, pr 
Ah, healing item. Gotcha. For some reason, for some reason, I thought that was a status item. Do you hear that music? That snazzy, jazzy music. You give to Jeff. No, don't reopen that. I am so happy that we're about to be here. This is one of the most awesome places in Earthbound. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Saturn Valley. We feel groove! This is seriously one of the... The heck do you mind out there? Also, it's a free inn! Also, Jeff just got an amazing weapon. And yet he's... Okay, maybe not that amazing. And yet he's still... Why? Why? I... Wait. There is an NPC that we can go to. Uh... Is it in this house? I hope it's in this house. Are you in this house? Yes! You're in a trash can. <laughs> I love the Mr. Saturns. They're just so adorable. You want me to operate on you? Ding! <laughs> Boing! What's in here? A r something to sell! Okay. Is it this one that we want to go in? It is, yes. Base behind Grapefruit Falls. Belchman say, say password, then stand still. Wait for three minutes. Okay, this is... This is pointing to something that you have to do very soon. You go to a certain place, and you literally... Once you talk to whatever thing is there, you literally stand still for three minutes. Yeah. Three freaking minutes. Okay, first, let's sell that bomb. Next, let's sell that copper bracelet. And lastly, okay, well, let's look at the buy. There's a lot of good stuff here. A lot of good stuff here. And thankfully, we have just enough money to be able to purchase all of it. Unfortunately, we're going to start missing a lot more with the slingshots. And yes, they, they are called bionic slingshot. You are looking at that correctly. <laughs> but, uh, I don't even remember which video it was in. There was an annotation in one of the videos that I did, I think it was the first video where you play as Jeff, where weapons with the shoot function, action, whatever it is, have a much higher chance at, at missing than weapons with bash. So we're going to be missing a lot more often. It's close to 20% of the time, which is really scary. I probably could have just zipped through all this, and I probably should have done so. I apologize for making you guys have to sit and watch this, but we're almost done. We're gonna sell... Uh, toy air gun, there we are. Nope, we're good, and just take a look. What do you buy? Or sell. These, these are good items. These are also good items. This is an interesting item. Oh, I forgot to sell the rust promoter, didn't I? Or did I already do that? Nope. Okay. <laughs> we're done with the buying and selling, I promise. No, I said we're, we're done. We are done. Uh, deposit. Now, we just went through $2,000. That will happen. 
And that's not even a lot of money. <laughs> What's really funny is making your dad say that he's deposited X amount of money into the bank account, and you've already spent it. What's really creepy, though, is the fact that he's able to pull up how much you have in your bank account right then and there. That is incredibly creepy. Now, these ladders don't actually go anywhere. At least, not immediately. And then, this one is just weird. <laughs> yeah. Also, hello, Mad Duck. Three is very, very weird. But... We know the secret. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I almost forgot. There's not. There's nothing there. <laughs> My bad. I didn't forget anything. So we basically explored the entirety of three, except for this one last little cave, and I forget what's in here. Ha! <laughs> trash cans. For tra. Are any of these useful? No, none of these are are useful. Uh, let's have you hold on to that. <laughs> Everyone's inventory is getting full. I'm I don't know why I'm actually glad about that. But we learned what we needed to. We upgraded. We did all that fun stuff. So let's get over to where we need to be. Now that we're all rested up and recovered and ready to go. Rested, recovered, and ready. The three R's. Of tr oh no. <laughs> We got lucky coming through here the first time. Ladies and gentlemen, the Violent Roach. It's dead. Good. I'm, I'm glad that that died as quickly as it did. I hate these things. They're just really annoying because I think one of... I think they can make you cry? I don't know. All I know is I just want to take it out as quickly as possible. They also do moderate damage. Are you dead? You're dead. Good. Uh, and then we get to sit through another level up. Yay! Jeff is already at a higher... Wait. <laughs> Jeff's at a higher level than Paula. Okay. Sure, we'll roll with that. Now, there's nothing scary out here, is there? No. So we'll just keep going. And, oh wow, this was much closer than I thought. Hi. Go away, please. I'm tired of you. Fuzzy Pickles! <coughs> I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> Sorry about that, people. Okay. This is the area right back here. Poof. That you go into. You talk to this guy. And you wait. And wait. So, I'm gonna go ahead and cut to where you're inside. Be right back. Okay. You may enter. That's how you do the password. You sit there and you wait. I literally called you like two minutes ago, Dad. No, no, no. Shoo. Okay, and... Because you tell him yes, you can pass without fighting. Otherwise, you would have had to fight him. I think that... Oh, I can show off the foppies. After this fight, it'll be a good time to call it. So, the foppies... One, they're adorable. Two, they're kind of like the attack slugs from the first cave. They give you a lot of experience points. They're really easy to kill. What's really nice is they call more of themselves, I think. But anyway, this is as good a time to call it here, if any. So thank you very much for watching. This has been Let's Play Earthbound with Destiny Insane. We are inside Belch's factory. Yes, the thing is named Belch. I will see you on the next episode, and stay classy. Later!